Hello, hello, good afternoon, welcome, guys. Thank you very much hello. for being in class. Hello, hello, hello. How are you today? Ready for the action? Yes. Excellent, very good. Okay, we're gonna start right now, guys, with the homework. Let's check the homework. And the homework was the question, what's your daily routine? Homework number one, Oscar. Homework assignment number one. Assignment two, the uh, positive, negative in question of third person, he, she, and, and, well, it was he and she. And the last one, it was, what's your daily routine to minutes? I need two volunteers to present this activity right now. What's your daily routine? So we can check how well you did it. Uh -huh. Who says me, teacher? Thank you, Sandra. And, oh my goodness, Ruth, Sandra, and Figueroa Rodriguez. Mita. Okay. Ruth, Janira, and Ormita. Ruth, star, please. What's your daily routine? Go ahead. This is part of my daily routine. I get up six o'clock and I cook the breakfast for my family. And then I get up my daughter ready for kindergarten. And also my baby. And we are going as a family to drop her off. And after that, I'm going to clean in the house and wash the clothes and wash the dish, dishes. And I like listening to music while doing all that. It's more fun. And um, I like that. Then we are going to kindergarten with my daughter and I cook the lunch. And after that, I help my daughter with her homework. And then I ready for my English class. And then I prepare dinner. I like to cook, but there are times when we go out to eat. And I like movie night with my family. Almost every day we watch a movie and finally I drink my relaxing tea and fall asleep. Good job, Ruth. Excellent. Mm -hmm. Only one thing. Only one thing. Drop my girl off. Mm -hmm. It's okay. Drop. Hello, hello. hello. Welcome, brother. But nice when you... Excellent. Ready for the action? Yes. I'm so happy. Very good. I'm so happy too. Thank you. I I done I finished the second unity. Oh the platform. Yes, sir. Wow. Now you now you are you are becoming a better student. Thank you. Thank you. Excellent. <laughs> I wanna be like you. I wanna be like you. <laughs> Come on. Extra points, extra points. <laughs> okay. Hey. 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 <laughs> okay. In the case of Ruth's presentation, only one thing, Ruth. Voy a dejar a alguien en la escuela, drop off, it's okay. El otro a, a recoger, pick up. No decimos traer, bring, sino que pick up, right? Then in, at 11 a.m., I go to school and pick up my daughter. Pick up, okay? Only that. The rest of the information, very good. Okay, volunteer number two, Sandra Yanina. Lights, camera, action, go. Hello, and my daily routine, I I got up, to up at, uh, I get up at 5.30 in the morning. I wake up my son to prepare him to go to a school. I take him to school at 7 and 7 and 30 in the morning. I am returned home. I prepare breakfast for my grandmother, my husband, and me. Um, I do laundry, clean the, the walls house around. 
11 or 11, 20, 20. Uh, in the morning, I start prepare lunch. Um, in the afternoon, I like to listen to the music, watch TV, have my son with his homework. Um, and I'm, and I'm prepare uh, my English class too. Um, at six in the afternoon, I make dinner. I clean the kitchen because I don't like that I eat that dirty. I am a little crazy with the clean. <laughs> and <laughs> at eight I night night and at eight at night I take my son to sleep. So he gets up early to go to school next day. I usually go to sleep at ten or eleven at night, almost away. And this is my daily routine every day. Um it's all. <laughs> Excellent, Sandrita, very good. Good job. Only one thing, when you said, I'm a little bit crazy with the cleaning. The cleaning. With, the, with the clean, no, with the cleaning, con la limpieza, right? Cleaning. Uh -huh. okay. Good okay. job, e excellent job. Dinas, daily routine, go. Okay. Oh, que va? No, no. No, yo, me. Yeah. Tina Lisa, go yes, ahead, yes. no problem. Okay. <laughs> uh, good afternoon, everyone. I work about uh, my daily routine. In my daily routine, uh, in the morning, I wake up very early because I do exercise or I work in the park. Other days, I go to the hospital with my sister and I have breakfast outside and I don't go to the hospital with her. I breakfast in my home. And after that, I clean my, my house and wash the dishes. After that, uh, at 11, I prepare lunch. At 12, I have lunch. In the afternoon, I make a jewelry and I sell uh, with my friends or online, and I have a page on Instagram, and at four, uh, I connect to my English class, and after that, at, at six o'clock, I prepare dinner for my family, and uh, at seven, I, I have dinner, uh, uh, after that, I watch TV with my family. Finally, I go to bed. On Saturday, I visit my, my sister or I visit uh, my cousin or I visit my husband aunt. And on Sunday, I go to the school and spend time with my family. Thank you. Wow, nice. Two minutes. Very yeah. good. Claps. Very good. Claps, please. Excellent job. Very good. Okay. Only one thing I would say that <clears throat> everything was very good. When you said, I breakfast at home, it is oh. more common to say, I have. Oh, okay. okay. <laughs> I have breakfast. The phrase is, I, I have breakfast. Okay. Okay, good. You can say, I do have breakfast, but when you give emphasis, right? For example, Stephanie, do you have breakfast in the morning or you don't have time for having breakfast? And Stephanie, yes, teacher, I do have breakfast. I have time for it. <laughs> Excellent. Next, who's next? Normita, Emma, and we finish with Walter. Lights, camera, action, go. Good afternoon, teacher. Good afternoon, class classmates. Mm -hmm. I'm going to tell you about my daily routine. Okay. It's six o'clock and it's time to get up for me. First, I sit on my bed and pray, and then I take a bath. A bath. When I I am when I'm ready. I wash the dishes and I put the clothes in the washing machine. 
after I cook the breakfast for my family. When I'm having breakfast, uh, I watch my favorite show and, and after I play Duolingo every day. I love it because I learn English in this application. Excellent. Then it's time for lunch. I make lunch and I watch the news every day at one o'clock in the afternoon. At three o'clock, I drink coffee and at three, and at 3.50, I get ready for my English class. When my English class is end, I do my homework and I practice the platform. Then I make dinner at seven o'clock and I go to bed at 10.30. It's end teacher. Excellent job, very good. Good job, Normita, thank you, thank you. Nice pronunciation, fluency, good job. Emma, go. Okay, my daily routine is I wake up at half past four. After that, I get up and take a shower. Then I get dressed. Also, I prepare a bottle of milk to my baby and change the clothes. After that, I start to put my business outside my house. Then I prepare all the ingredients for the sale. Then my son wakes up and he drinks his milk. After that, I cook the breakfast. Then I eat the breakfast with my son. After that, I wash the dishes. Maybe half past to nine or 10, I finish with the cell. Then I feed my dog. After that, I bath my son and I play with him. Then I clean my house. Besides, I prepare the lunch. Usually I eat my lunch at 1 p.m. Then I wash the dishes again. And sometimes I rest one hour and I watch a movie or anime series if there is some new episode of my favorite series. Then my son take a nap while I do the laundry or clean the kitchen or tidy the room. Then when it is quarter to four, I get ready for my English class while I make a cup of coffee. Then I have my English class for four o'clock to half past five p.m. Then if we were left homework, I do it. After that, I walk around the neighborhood with my son until 6 p.m. Then we come back home and I prepare the dinner for my family. After that, we eat the dinner at uh, half past seven. Then my son go to the bed at half past eight. And my couple and I watch a movie or the news. Finally, we go to the bed at 10 p.m. That's it. Nice, good job, excellent. Claps. Claps, please. Very good. And the emojis, excellent. Santos Fidelina, Romita. Only one thing, I eat breakfast, it's okay, no problem. It's very nice. More common, have breakfast, but it's okay if you say eat. It's fine. And finally, we finish with Walter. One, two, three, go. Generally, from Monday to Friday, I wake up at 3 a.m. to prepare a coffee cup and then to take a shower. Around 3 a.m., uh, 3.50 a.m., I go out to take a bus to go to the university. Uh, I arrive at the university between 5 and 6 a.m., so I have breakfast there almost every day. Since 7 to 11 a.m., I take my classes, and after that, I study while I, I am at the university, but at the 12.45 MD, I go to the bus station to, to come back to my house. Uh, between 3 to 4 p.m., I arrive to my house and I rest a bit uh, before participating in the English Zoom meeting with speak with you. 
they might do homeworks to go to go to the bed at a nine or nine in a half p.m. Thank you. Good job, excellent. Nice, nice. Wow, you wake up really early, brother. And what time do you usually go to bed, you said? 9 p.m. Is it 9 p.m. the time you go to home, you go to bed? Microphone, brother, microphone. Yes, 9 or 10 p.m. Okay, good. Wow. Thank you very much for your participations. It means that you finished, you practiced your activities. Something that I liked is that in the case of Normita, uh, and I know other people in the class also are using apps like Duolingo to continue learning, continue practicing, okay? That's really interesting. Something that caught my attention. In groups, please, the people that didn't participate in groups, Give or tell your daily routine, please. Five minutes in groups. People that didn't participate. Of course, this activity was only for four or five people, not all the class because we don't have time. But in groups, when you go to groups, it's your opportunity to shine bright like a diamond and show your English. Tell your daily routine in this case. Lights, camera, action, go.
lunch and then I have another class to uh, from 1 to 3 p.m. and if I have a lot of homework I do homework and then I get ready to enter in this class and after this class um, when it's Tuesday or Thursday I go to the church and when I arrive to the church I have my my dinner and after my dinner I pray to the Lord I read the scripture and then then I go to bed around 10 p.m. and that's it good job No sé si Jesse is here. Um, yes. Um, okay. I I wake up at six thirty a.m. and then I take a shower and I prepare the breakfast and then I I I take the breakfast then at eight. O'clock. I have a class of the university, and and it is the few class. And at at ten o'clock, I have the second class on the university until twelve twelve o'clock, and then and then I I clean the house and then I study and. And then I take a lunch, a lunch at one o'clock. Then I I wash the dishes, brush my teeth, and then I I study again and and, and worry for the class English class. And, and when when at Five o'clock, no, no, uh, five thirty, thirty p.m. I, I do a, a little exercise. Then I, I take a, a dinner, and then I study again. And I go to the bed at nine thirty p.m. Is that Good job. Eh, ya estamos todas, ¿verdad? No sé si Eva o Sandrita querrá decirlo de nuevo. Muy poquito, teacher. Mr. Wilber. 
Echar el crema y así dejarlo en calzoncillo porque. Anda por mi casa. Sorry, guys. Teacher. Anda trayendo. No, brother. Tú no es short the time. Ah. Es short time. It was not enough. No. <laughs> Voy a estar en the time is over. Okay, I'm gonna switch groups. Let's switch groups then. Tres. Like lemon, yeah. orange, coconut okay. plants, Una pura, tres nomás. banana plants, ginger included. After that, I make aerobic routine, like walk around the football field. And quickly, after my physical routine necessary, For my left arm and left leg, who I don't know work properly. Like wrestle, or I suffer a uh, accident, cerebrovascular. After all that, I keep going every morning in attendance of a lot of hands on my knees farm. I can move this night with my family. Almost every day, we watch a movie, and finally, I drink my relaxing tea and fall asleep. Finish. <laughs> Good job. <laughs> uh, who is the next? ¿Quién falta? Ahora no. Yeah, I already did. Okay.
Okay, very good. Let's see. Another activity that was for today was to practice third person, right? He, she, right? In this case, he plays soccer. He doesn't play soccer. Does he play soccer? Yes, he does. No, he does. She eats pupusas. She doesn't eat pupusas. Does she eat pupusas? Yes, she does. No, she doesn't. Jenny sells apples. Jenny doesn't sell apples. Does Jenny sell apples? Yes, yes. she does. No, she doesn't. doesn't. Okay, quickly, on your notebook, three sentences, one using he, one using she, and other sentence using the name of a person, a boy or a girl, no problem, or a girl. Quickly, please, two minutes. Two minutes, when you finish, raise your hand. The emojis. The emojis. If you if you have the questions already, raise your hand. Okay, thank you. Excellent. Raise your hand. When I see all the hands up, we continue. Very good. Very good. Okay, thank you. Three sentences. Three sentences. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Very nice. Very good. Thank you. More people, please. Only three sentences. Only three. Uh -huh. There are still some people. No la bajen, okay? Ahí manténganla, porque así vamos viendo. Quienes ya terminaron, que ahí déjenla con la mano alzada. Very good. Okay, good job. Okay, very good. Now that you have the three sentences, let me see, Jose Humberto, please. Jose, you will give me examples with Alison. Thank you. Okay, Jose, you give one example in the positive to Alison. Alison repeats positive, negative question, two possible answers, and then we repeat the activity. Alison to Jose. Jose repeats the positive, changes in the negative question and two possible answers. Jose, to Alison, go. One example. Carlos works at the post office. Alison, repeat. Carlos works at the office. Post office. Post office. Negative? Right. Give me a moment, please. No problem.
I get it. Good. Sorry. Um, do we, do we is Carlos work the post office? Um, in that case, is a... No. Look at the example. Look at my screen. Carlos doesn't. Sorry. Uh -huh. Okay, go ahead. Carlos, oh, Carlos doesn't. doesn't. Carlos doesn't work at the post office. Excellent example. Pay attention to Alison. Carlos doesn't work. Mm. When you use doesn't, the verb is? Work. In the base form. Work. In the base form. The verb the is base. normal. So, yes. Carlos doesn't work. work. Okay. Not necessarily work. the S. The S only in the positive. Continue, continue. Question. Right. Does Carlos? Do S. Do es Carlos work? Do es, do es is does. Does Carlos? Does Carlos work in the post office? Two possible answers. Uh, he yes, yes he did. Yes he does. No. He remember, does, remember, remember is da. does. Does 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 do es. Because you remember do, do homework. I do homework, we do homework. But in the third person, the pronunciation, does, yes. does, okay? Yes, he does. No, he? He doesn't. Doesn't, very good. Alison, example to Jose, please. Okay. He cries for the movie. Jose? He cries for the movie. He doesn't cry for the movie. Mm -hmm. Does he cry for the movie? Yes, he does. No, he doesn't. Very good. So look, similar activity that we have yesterday. The same activity, but the diff the, the activity now is third person. No, we, no, he, no, sorry, no, we, no, they, no, I, he, she, in the name of a person. So mm -hmm. be careful, be careful. Doesn't go, doesn't sell. When you use doesn't, the verb normal, okay? Quickly, seven minutes in groups, practice speaking, only speaking, and fast, fast, okay? Lights, camera, action. Voy a hacerlo de menos personas, de menos personas para que puedan tener más oportunidad de participar, okay? Si, en, uh, si hay personas que están de oyentes, que hasta ahorita no, no me ha escrito nadie diciéndome, teacher, yo voy a estar de oyente por esto y esto. Se supone que si entra un grupo, todos tendrían que estar participando. No en silencio, un grupo totalmente muerto. Ok, si usted está en un grupo que están así, rápido, mándeme un mensaje. Teacher, send me to other group. Teacher, my name is fulana, fulano, o I am fulano, I am in group tal. O estoy con fulano y sultano, send me to our group. Yo, I send you to our group. Okay? One, two, three, go.
Oh, she. Who okay. wrote? Okay. I, I hear he. Okay. okay. He doesn't, no, she doesn't uh, go to the beach. Does what? she go to the beach? Um. Yes, she does. No, she doesn't. You can use like um, in my example, in the negative form, is she doesn't like to go to the beach. She doesn't like. Uh huh. She doesn't like to go. Oh, okay, okay. So... And in, in the in the question is does she like like does she like to go? Oh, okay. I eat the like. <laughs> Uh, okay. Coach, uh, coach okay. I, I have a question. Your example is okay. In the case of Miriam, didn't add the like, but you can you you have to add it because the example is like to go. So it will be like, uh -huh. he doesn't like to go. Does he like to go or she like to go? Uh -huh. it, For the next my question is okay, go ahead. In my question is the other example. Go ahead. And in, in the case, um, he goes running with the, we don't use ENG. He goes running? Yes, it's okay. Running because when we use go for certain activities, it's a rule in English. Like for example, certain activities are with go. And certain activities, the phrase is with do. And other activities is with play. For example, you don't say playing soccer, you say play soccer. I like to play soccer. Uh, you don't say I like to do soccer. But for example, in the case of karate, the sport of karate, you don't say I play karate. In English, it's not common I play karate. It's more common I do, the verb do karate. So in this case of running, the, the activity of running, it's more common to say go running. Go so, running. Go running. In this case, running is an activity, not a verb in ING. Uh, I, in, in my case, I write, he goes running with his friends. It's excellent. It's nice. You change go because go is the principal verb, is the main verb. Goes running. So goes because it's third person. He. Mm -hmm. No problem. It's fine. Ah, okay. Very good. Thanks, coach. Good job. Next, next person, please. Quickly, quickly, quickly. My example. Okay, your example two. Is... You, she... will give the, you will give Natalie the example to whom? To Maria, to Emma, to Carlos, to. Huh? To My example is she work, works I know sorry. Is Mario goes on the bus. Mario goes on the bus. Or you can say goes by bus. Goes mm -hmm. by bus. Okay, who? Choose a person, Natalie. Emma. Or what is the order, Carlos? Um, you are in um... I, I write an other example and my brother goes to the store. Yes, yes, Carlos. But what is the order? ¿Quién le pregunta a quién? ¿Quién le dice a quién? ¿O están así en, en the store? Random. At random. <laughs> At random. Okay. Quickly in order. Carlos to Miriam. Miriam to Maria Andrea. Maria Andrea to Natalie. Natalie to Emma. Emma to Carlos. Sí, en círculo. Dijo Natalie una horita, va para okay. Emma. Emma para Carlos. Carlos para, yes. Okay. Emma, did you listen to the to Natalie's sentence? Um, yes, but I don't pay attention. You can, can you repeat, please? Excellent. You didn't pay attention. No problem. It's fine. Repeat, please, okay. Natalie. The example is Mario goes by bus. Mm -hmm. mm, Mario. Mario doesn't go by bus. 
by bus. By bus, by bus. Mm -hmm. um, does Mario go by bus? Mm -hmm. Yes, he does. No, he doesn't. Good job. Next, continue to Carlos' example. Okay, my answer to my sentence to Carlos is she draws a landscape. Uh, can you repeat? She draws a landscape. She. Sí. Pero compra la memoria. Yeah. You finished? Yes. Yes. Okay, it's time to go back then. Mm -hmm. okay. Okay, let's go. If you finished, Alison, ready? What is the pronunciation, yeah. Alison? Does or does? Does and doesn't. Very good. <laughs> let's go, let's go. Learn the, the lecture. Yeah, she learned. Okay. Um, next activity, please, is going to be in groups. Yes, in groups. And this activity will be a role play. But first, let me give you an example, guys. Let me give you an example. Cuando los mande en grupos. Okay, vamos a ver este ejemplo. Para aprovechar más el tiempo, lo estoy explicando en español, no microphones, please. Alguien rápido y no se molesten si alguien toma la batuta, ¿ok? No, en este grupo no pasa, no, no me ha dicho nunca nadie, teacher, mire que fulano nos dice esto. Y si así fuera, pues la idea es avanzar en el tiempo. Veamos este ejemplo. Entró primero, un ejemplo, Natalie. Natalie fue la que ingresó primero. De repente entró Emma, luego Carlos, luego Miriam, el último, María Andrea, por ejemplo. Natalie puede tomar la decisión y decir, ok, guys, hello, welcome. Try to speak English all the time. Well, uh, for this activity, uh, in my opinion, Ella puede decir, in my opinion, Emma is number one, I am number two, eh, Marie Andrea number three, Carlos four, and Miriam five. Un ejemplo. O, o así como ustedes lo ven en la pantalla. No sé si les aparece el mismo orden a todos, pero la persona que toma la, digamos que Emma dice, Emma. Ok, guys, the order is, y dan un orden, siempre den un orden cuando es actividad así. Podemos comenzar con Carlos, pasando a Miriam, María Andrea, Natalie, Emma, y luego Carlos. Entonces, ok. Very good. Entonces, Carlos le dice una oración a Miriam. Miriam la pasa en las tres formas. Ella le da una a María, María le da una a Natalie, Natalie a Emma otra vez, y luego Carlos, y así. Si no contesta María Andrea, pues saltamos aquí. No contestó Carlos, pues yo solo directo aquí. Yes. Pero al menos, cabal, pero al menos tres rounds. Ya pasamos cada uno, cada quien ya hizo la suya y ya el tiempo ahí hay todavía, no nos han llamado, pues siga con otro ejemplo. Ya dijimos las tres, siga con otro ejemplo. Es que qué aburrido, yo quiero hablar de otra cosa, hablemos de esto, pero háblelo en inglés. Pero si va, a... ajá, pues sí, ya terminaron un ejemplo, porque a veces yo estoy en otros grupos y esos grupos me hacen alguna pregunta o alguien no entiende. Ajá, no sé, usted ha terminado en su grupo, lo hicieron así. Y quieren hablar de algo más, no hay no problema, it's okay. Quieren hablar de, de no sé, que el Salvador hoy a las 8 y que, que piensan que va a ganar o perder y que hay que Messi si ganan el lunes y uno aquí. Ay, Dios. Solo por, pues sí, mejor jugador de fútbol hubiéramos sido y que mejor no hubiéramos para el pan. O sea, de lo que quieren, pues sí. 
ay, es que mira que mucho me escriben y ustedes que no sé qué. qué. Aquí en English, in English, ah, empiecen en in English. No llegó ayer y ayer que viene y que hicieron, ah, no, que no. En English. Pero yo entro a los grupos y están ahí, sí, que yo tengo un novio y vos que no sé qué, no, pero que te hago. Hey. Que yo le dije que fuéramos ahí. No quise. Así no. Está bien, pero en in English, en in English. English. All information in English. Information in English. No problem. Teacher, okay. excuse me. Ajá, uh -huh. hello. $10. Eh, hello. Este, fíjense que tengo una duda. Eh, eh, es un ejemplo de que me dio un compañero, ¿verdad? Y decía, uh -huh. my dot is lit in my bed. Eh, ya luego nomás la negativa, ¿verdad? My uh -huh. dot doesn't sleep in my bed. Uh -huh. The question is, does my dot sleep in my bed? Eh, the possible answer in my, in my question, ¿verdad? Is correct, eh, yes, he does, or yes, it does. No, he doesn't, or no, it doesn't. Excellent job. Good, good question. When you talk about animals, if the animal has a name, he, she. For example, the animal Pepito, he. <laughs> the animal eh, Negra, she. Uh -huh. O a, a nombre de, de animal. Luna. Lula, Luna. she, Luna. Uh -huh. she. If you don't know the name of the animal, imagine... Imagine a uh, spider. Mm -hmm. Eat. The spider, a spider bites the flies, or the spider eats flies. Mm -hmm. So the answer that does the spider, does a spider eat flies? Yes, eat. I see in general because spiders don't have names. We don't give names mm -hmm. to spiders. Uh -huh. Right, a menos a Spider-Man, okay, that's another thing. Okay, uh, good. Uh, huh? Teacher, entonces en este caso que me solo me estaban diciendo que era un perro, entonces eh, a ah, it, verdad? Excellent, ah, very okay. good. Thank you, thank you. You're welcome, no problem. Ten dollars, ten dollars, please. <laughs> donas, donas. Eh, pedido ya. Hey. I don't like. You don't like donuts. Ay, no. No. Me too. Ay. Mejor, Ay. sí que mejor, pero pues sí. Uno ve el montón de gente ahí, uno dice, bitch. Oh. ¿Y qué ir a comer? Are delicious. Qué? Are delicious with coffee. Delicious no. with coffee. With coffee. No, no, no. Una vez al año. Donuts, una vez but al no, año. the donuts to no. Mr. Donut. Oh, a lot What? of sugar. No. Sugar. Ew. Okay. I don't like. <laughs> Activity. Okay. Uh huh. Come. Eh, role play in this moment. Groups. This is an oral evaluation. Ah, come. Yes. Eh, six groups. A lot of people. Demasiado hombre. Hombre, gente aquí. La normita le dice, ay Dios, hombre. <risa> no, okay, in groups. I like it, I like, like it. Like it, excellent. In groups, as it, the situation is this, you are a family. This is a real life situation. You are a family, mom and dad. Mom and dad, teacher. Mom, dad, teacher. The, the level the level of the teacher is your decision. Kindergarten, first grade, third grade, high school, university is, is your decision. For example, group number one. Maria Andrea, Marielos, Carla, Jessica, and Ulises. Mother. Jessica, the mother, Ulises, the father. Ay, <laughs> You have no money right now. You have no money. I go to the bank as for a loan. Ulises teacher. 
Sí, demasiado. No. <risa> <risa> Carla, <risa> Carla Liliana de Teacher. Marielos en María are the students. Ulises and Jessica's son, in this case, daughters. What is the problem? Carla, the teacher, calls Ulises and Jessica through Zoom, in a video call in Zoom. <clears throat> Let's say, okay, uh, good afternoon, uh, Ms. Marroquin uh, and Mr. Valencia. My name is Carla Liliana. As you know, I am the teacher of Maria Andrea and Marielos. Um, this meeting is with the purpose y le dicen, mire, eh, eh, gracias por estar en esta reunión, le agradecemos mucho y reportan que se están portando mal, no llevan tareas <ríe> llevan muy dinero el dinero que llevan eh, se lo dan a otros amiguitos no sé, compran golosinas están y, los y las golosinas <ríe> las, se las comen en, en la clase ¿Quién le dio la reunión de mi hijo? Si es, ¿Eh? si es, ya ven, la puedo. Así fue. Ya ven, si es que. Vamos a jugar los juegos, teacher, en la tarde. Un cabal. No le gusta que sean muy chiquitos los hijos, o sea, más grandes. Pues. Entonces, high school, no están problem. en high school. No problem. Eh, que María, María Luz y María Andrea andan solo con los novios, no entran a casa no. con el novio. Eh, una de ellas eh, se peleó con otra porque le dio los no, mensajes de WhatsApp o no sé qué. Es complicado. Complicated. Ajá. Entonces se, dice, se indigna Ulises y Jessica. Maybe con, con the police. Y, y, ajá. Y le dice, y le dice a Carla, le explica a, a, a teacher Carla que, que, que it's unbelievable. We don't understand. No sabemos por qué se comportan así. No, Marielos no tiene teléfono. Ahí que van a usar. Doesn't. Oh, okay, teacher Carla, we feel really embarrassed right now. We don't understand. Uh, we know that they are teenagers um, and they do a lot of things in this in this, this age, right? But I don't, don't understand that you say that Marielos is on the cell phone all the time because she doesn't have a cell phone. At least we didn't buy or, or no le hemos comprado. El, el, el año pasado ya quería un teléfono y no se lo compramos porque entendemos que no es correcto para su edad ¿eh? ah, entonces María sí tiene celular porque ella es más responsable trata de pero usted dice que ella tiene novio y nosotros no sabemos de eso ni que... <risa> y ahí le dice Ulises sí me extraña porque la rutina de ella es esta le dice la rutina no todo pues pero hace ah, levantar no, tres horas eh, vemos lo otro, pasamos solo trabajando nosotros, no tenemos tiempo en la casa, solo los sábados y domingos pero la señora que las cuida dice que hacen todo Carla, la profesora solo les va a decir les va a informar, les va, y al final les va a decir sí, yo entiendo que ustedes fueron papás pues pasan ocupados la idea es que hablen con sus hijas y pues traten de ayudarles, hasta ahí gracias por su tiempo, me retiro bla bla, bla. ahí vean ustedes, verdad <risa> hey, y ese que, que Ulises se enojan y ya le dicen a María y a María los que vengan. Ok, y le dice Ulises: Va, mira, Jessica, vamos a esperar que vengan estas fichas. Voy a agarrar con el cincho. <risa> ya, Jessica se calma y le dice: No, el cincho no es la solución. Mm. Jessica le dice: Ay, Dios, y dices, hombre. La pita de la luz duele más. ¿eh? Ay, ya está bueno. Está bueno. No, porque tiene... vamos a atacar a lo que más le duele. ¿Qué es lo que le gusta hacer a ella? Vamos al teléfono. Ah, la le... es que ellas salen con sus amigas. Bueno, salidas. Le damos camisa? dinero para ir a. Ah, no, dinero. Eh, <risa> vamos a hacer un área de que hagan limpieza, que hagan esto. ¿Quieren dinero? Que laven el carro, que laven los baños, que laven. Hasta que hay que enseñarles lo que cuesta la vida. Dando no. Para el control. Para el control. Ahí sí es. Ahí hacen los japoneses. Ahí quiere este dinero. Va, pues lave el carro. Cuando termine, le voy a... Porque se acostumbra a trabajar. Yeah. Ok. María y María le, le, ahí le dicen. Right? Pasado. Utilicen todo. Ya, ya vimos pasado. Este es un repaso y le dice a María Andrés, ok, María, Marielo, sit down. Thank you very much. Ah, you came a little bit late from school. 
Okay. Um, uh, mom, it, it's 2 p.m. You, you are working at this moment. Yes, <laughs> we are working right now, but we had an emergency with your teacher and we came home early. I talked to my boss and he gave me permission to be here in the class at the home. And I am very happy. Uh, okay, okay, dad. Uh, yes, listen to your dad, please. Listen to your dad. <laughs> and yeah, yeah, like, yes, que le dice. Su maestro nos reunió y nos dijo muchas cosas. Entran a clases. Tienen OnlyFans. Tienen OnlyFans. <laughs> y esto y luego dicen que andan con no sé qué es, otro Facebook. <laughs> eh, Mariela dice que you have, a, you have a boyfriend. I don't understand. Ajá. Mm -hmm. Y ahí se excusa. Y dicen, no, la maestra dice eso porque no me quiere. No, y yo ya. tengo edad para tener novio. Él, él es solo mi amigo. Y que no me quiere. <laughs> no sé. What is the idea? The idea is to use your English in a real life situation. Include present simple, past simple. Okay, mom and dad. Aquí ya saben algunos otros temas. Will, going to, todo lo que pueda ir. Al final, lo que pasa en cualquier cosa, ¿qué van a hacer entonces? Okay. Because you are not giving me good grades. María Andrea, no cell phone from now on. One month without cell phones. Okay. Mom, why are you so bad to me? I am doing my best. No cell phones, I'm sorry. In one month, if you improve your grades, I'm going to talk to teacher Carla. If teacher Carla says you are doing a good job at school, your cell phone is back. No problem. And in the yeah. case of Marielos, no time, um, no, no time with your friends. Saturday and Sundays. I, I am going to Emma's house. No. I'm going to the movies with Fulana. No. no. You're staying at home, helping your mother. Cleaning the house, washing the car, studying. Yes. Se va María lo hice la puerta. Póngale ahí. El, el efecto. Pa, hacer la puerta. My mom ya va, you. Ya va a volver. Dice, es que te dije que el cincho le iba. Ay, Dios. Descubrí. Solo el cincho. Eh. Yeah. <laughs> María, los open the door. Go away, dad. Go away. <laughs> Right. And finish. <laughs> but did you did you understand, right? No go out, no going out with your friends. Yes, yes, I got it. Bye bye. <laughs> Include all your English. I am going to give you 15 minutes in this moment to prepare. Tomorrow I give you more time. Pero después de clase, practiquen un poco más. A la hora que ustedes puedan. Tomorrow I give you more time, 10, 15 minutes to practice and then you present. This is the oral activity of unit one. Okay, uh, lights, camera, action, go.
Uh, I am going to share a screen, but we have we can is great. Okay. Now I had a short a short paragraph. Ah, okay. Like a teacher and for the beginning. Uh -huh. Ustedes me dicen si está bien. Dice, hello, Mr. Sanchez. I'm glad to hear you. Well, I have bad news about your daughter, Neldi. She's coming late to class and is having problems with Sandra. ¿Qué les parece? It's great for a start. It's, it's great. <laughs> it's okay. Okay. If you want to write in the chat, okay, ready. and I copy. Mm -hmm. okay. um, <clears throat> two other two girls is not here, I think. Uh, Tim uh, will. Will it by call or meeting at the school? For mm. phone or, or for meeting? Okay. So after the teacher, uh, the teacher asked to Jose Umto, right? Yes. Okay, it's for call, so for call or, or in persona. Mm. Or for phone. But maybe it can be the video call. Zoom meeting. Ah, uh, yeah. Okay. And, uh, well, after the teacher, the Jose Humberto, you have to answer. Yes. Yancy uh, put the message in the, yeah. in the group. Right now, I copy and paste.
I I think uh, the first paragraph uh, will be until about your daughter because my my answers no sé si ya la vieron en el en el grupo y de ahí then then usted me puede responder she's coming late yeah 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 I I see <laughs> you got it yeah yeah I got it <laughs> okay. I, I'm here. Y usted le ha puesto her. Le faltó una E en I'm here. Yes. Thank you. Así está bien. Yes. Ok. Ok. Mm. En... What we what happened? Hello, uh -huh. can you hear me? Yes, ah, sorry, <laughs> se me desaparecieron las <laughs> la casilla, por eso <laughs> pensé que me había sacado. <laughs> del chat <ríe> pensé que me había sacado de zoom <ríe> ok vale eh, vamos aquí teacher sorry no worry John you write another message eh, yes I write uh, I need that you talk to her and ask why is she feeling angry with Sandra Can you add this part, please, Emma? Sorry, sorry. <laughs> um, okay, and then the, the when the teacher says Sneldi is coming late to class and he's having problems with Sandra, um, and then Neldi eats Sandra's breakfast. Uh -huh. I entonces, Ahí me puede decir, Mr. Sánchez, algo antes de lo que yo le he escrito, me puede decir. Okay. Yo o my wife. Ah, ajá, your wife. Um... Uy. 
puede decir, mi hija no es así. Yeah. <risa> Está vieja y confiable. Ajá, uh, my daughter is not like that. Ajá. Uh -huh. Is not or does not? No sé cómo. Yo solo lo, lo, solo lo pensé rápido. My daughter is not like that, but I know si está correcto. Teacher, we can, you can help. Can you help us? <laughs> Teacher is my daughter is not like not that like or that. doesn't like doesn't That's... like. Ahorita. Qué feo es el papá soltero aún. <laughs> I think we should talk to my talk to my teacher to clear things up. Don't you think? I let me talk to her. I tell you tomorrow. Okay. Okay. Do the homework. Yeah, I'm do the homework. Yes, okay, okay, very good. It's time to go now. The only activity for tomorrow is oral presentation. Okay, photo one, two, three. Excellent job. Bye bye. See you tomorrow. Bye. bye. bye.